Hey y'all, Russ here at Food TV. Welcome. Check it out. We're in 89. We're heading south. Going back through the little community of Cameron. There's that Tanner Crossing Bridge. We explored on the way up north. What an epic journey we've been on. We're going to take this little roundabout and guess what? Fasten the seat belts. We're heading to the Grand Canyon. Yay! This is Highway 64 right here, 64 West. We're actually going to go in the east side of Grand Canyon. We're going to do something a little bit different. I've filmed up here a few times. So I thought this is, we're in this area. This is going to be absolutely perfect to see something different around the Grand Canyon. Matter of fact, right up the road here, is uh well what do they call it little colorado river gorge overlook <laughs> i passed it up last time i came through there i drove through here the other direction oh it's been a while at least two three years ago and i didn't stop this time we're gonna stop here it is here looks open We're gonna go check it out like right now. Okay, they're not even taking money to get in. You know, they still have uh, pretty strict COVID regulations going on the Indian reservations. All right, let's get parked. Go check it out. Cool, they got some vendors set up. Not too many. Yeah, I drove past this uh, three years ago. Didn't stop. Looks like they got three or four of them set up. Perfect weather. Look at this. Wow, this is pretty nice. Looks like they're working on it, putting in some new guardrails. I see a canyon up there. <laughs> Oh, wait till we get up to the Grand Canyon. Woohoo. Yay. It's an epic day. Yay. What do we got? A little map of the area. Shows you a little bit. Little Colorado River Gorge. Feeds off the main Colorado. Navajo Silver Smithing. Long time tradition. Oh, look at the weaving. Huh. I'd like to see them doing that. More of their artwork. Okay, well, let's wander down to the gorge. Yeah, it's all brand new fencing. Whoa, <laughs> oh man, that's a long ways down there. Doesn't look like the little Colorado River's running right now. I bet it does in the springtime. It's kind of a neat little uh, place here. Okay, if you don't like heights, close your eyes. <laughs> Looking over. Wow, look at the rock formations, huh? Yeah, that's all dried up down there. Oh, 
Well, let's go peek over on the other side before we leave. Pretty rocky area. I think I'm taking the hard way down here. <laughs> this is just a preview of coming attractions when we get up to the big canyon, huh? But the terrain is flat as a pancake and this crevice just runs through it. But there's a ton of wildlife. Whole ecosystem here. Yeah, this is all brand new fencing. Well, down here is about as far as I can go out. It's kind of the end of it. Try to look over. The, the fence kind of holds you back. You can't get too close. So there, it's kind of shaded, but that's where the river runs through. It's kind of dried up right now. Must run seasonal. There you go. Little Colorado River Gorge. Right here off Highway 64, and we're heading to the Grand Canyon. You know, some of that down there probably never even sees sunshine. Alright, well, kind of cool. Let's head for the van. See what the vendors have. It's like a little pottery, some arrows, dream catchers, pretty cool looking jewelry. Yeah, not too many of them set up. All right, I don't need nothing. Hi, how are you? Away we go, big parking lot here. Okay, I think we only got about 15 miles to be up at the canyon. Here we go. Look how flat it is. You know, when you think of the Grand Canyon, you think there'd be big mountains and all that. Uh -huh. It's flat and all of a sudden you're in a big hole in the ground. <laughs> Perfect. I'm hoping to catch some fall colors up here too when, once we get up in the trees. There's quite a few around the big canyon. Good road, perfect weather. We'll be there shortly. Now it's changing. There's some of the little pines. We're getting in National Forest here. Getting closer. Okay, I think we're getting real close. You know, they had this eastern entrance closed for over a year because of COVID. Now we're getting into federal land. 
But you couldn't even drive through here for over a year. They had the entrance closed. Here you go, we're in it. Welcome to the Grand Canyon National Park Eastern Entrance. Should be a check-in place right up here. And I got my senior discount card. For, I get in for free. I've used that uh, this access card I don't know how many times. It's saved me a bundle. Because to get into the canyon up here, it's $35 a car. I paid $80 for the pass, and uh, it's lifetime. If you're over 62, check it out. Gives you access, access to camping, discounts, all kinds of good stuff. Here it is. Yay! Slowing us down. Welcome to the Grand Canyon. We'll stop along the way on the coming in up from this direction. There's kind of cool stops. I've always wanted to do this, and we're going to do it like right now. Let me get through here. Yep, 35 bucks. And it should be right up here. On the right hand side will be the first little access. It's called Desert Watchtower, something like that. Never stop there, I want to do it this time. Should be fun. Here it is. I mean, right past the entrance. Is this uh, watchtower place? There's all kinds of tour buses that come up through here. Excursions you can take. But we're taking the RV or TV one. <laughs> okay, RV's to the left here. Let me park over on this side. Go for a walk. How's this for front row parking? <laughs> cool. Looks like their visitor center right there. All right, let's go for a walk. Well, looks like the rangers outside of the table, they still got all their COVID stuff going. I don't need to stop up there. Look at them with a mask and a pointer. <laughs> Desert View Visitor Center. Okay, it's Desert View Watchtower. I've seen pictures of this thing. I, I've never stopped here as many times I've been up here at the canyon. Really never come in on the east side over here. It's always through the south, the south rim. Here's some pictures. Wow, look how big that thing is. Huh. Discover Grand Canyon. Exploring the east. Yes, we are. Because we're a good 20 miles, at least, to get over to the south rim. Coming in this direction. Shows you how big this place is. Alright, you got restrooms. Little buildings, probably administrative. The 
look at the captivating canyon they take some of the best pictures for them big storyboards this is a photographer's dreamland here catch different sunrises and sunsets and different times of year Desert View Trading Post, little gift shop, snack bar. I'm not gonna go inside. There's the tower, look at that thing. They built it in the 30s or something like that. So what would that make it, 90 years old? And what's this say? Tower is closed. Oh, man. <laughs> Darn. Well, outside looking in, huh? <laughs> hey, we're here. Doesn't care. I don't care. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I see a Grand Canyon coming up. There's so many. This would be pretty much the start of it over here. Eastern end of the Grand Canyon. Look at the stonework in that thing. What's this say? How the canyon measures up. Alright, get ready. Hang on. Wow, an airplane crashed here. Huh. Never knew. Here you go. Welcome to the Grand Canyon. Quite a few people here. I'll work my way down to the viewing area. There it is. The very start of it. Here you go. Wow. Never seen it from this end. Pretty cool. Trying to squeeze in here without getting in people's way of taking their selfies. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous. There you go. Now let me zoom in. Now you can actually see the Colorado River down there. Pretty darn impressive, huh? There's the mighty Colorado. Well, too bad we can't go inside. They got a gift shop, I don't care about that, but up in the tower. Yeah, one of these years. Built in the 30s. Imagine the amount of people have been in this thing. Huh. Well, let's head back for the van. Oh, look at this. Look at this storyboard. See what this says. Deep time. Huh. 
Look at this. They got their own little overlook and no one's here. <laughs> Down there fighting the crowd at the other one. Well, here you go. Let's check this one out. Now we're talking. Look at this one. Yeah, you can really see the river all the way down there. Way down that direction is the south rim. And across the north rim. Down there is the river. Cool. And the tower. No fence here either. <laughs> Don't take a selfie and back up too far. A lot of people have. There's people that kind of fall off the edge here. Okay, well, pretty cool little stop. Desert View Watchtower. We're not even a quarter mile from the east entrance here. We're barely into the park itself. So we'll get back up on 64. I just kind of Google mapped it. And looks like we got about three or four good overlooks to check out on the way in. Really glad I came in this direction. This will be a totally different look. Yay. Yeah, it's a good 25 miles clear into the Grand Canyon Village, what they call it, South Rim and all that. Hopefully we'll catch some fall colors. Coming up next, more Grand Canyon. Journey continues. Talk soon.